Um, ladies, this is the part you've been waiting for, DIY tutorials. And of course, uh, we have Oi Onarinde right here, the CEO of Airware Hair. And she's here to teach us something very, very important today because conditioning your hair is very, very important. So Oi, what are we talking about today? Hi, Winfrey. Hello. Yeah, so we're going to be talking about, you know, how we are going to, how to get your, um, your conditioners last longer. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, you have, you know, this very attachment you know, to some kind of product, you know what I mean? True, uh, true, true. Yes, and then, you know, your hair is quite full, it takes a lot of product, mm -hmm. you know, and you're looking for methods, I mean, the best methods. Are you methods. talking to me, Derek? I think you're talking to me. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like you're talking to me. <laughs> yes. So, like, you know, the, the, the best methods, you yeah. know, to keep your conditioners last long in. Yes, okay. So, yeah. Okay, so can you give us, now, what exactly, because the truth is, yes, um, a lot of people... Um, buy products and because of the prices on them, they actually like to buy um, the bigger ones so they can right. last longer. However, right. I know so before I get to the bottom of my conditioner, it must dry. <laughs> Why must it dry? <laughs> Some people say, okay, fine, probably the um, weather condition, probably where you store it, how you store it, and all right. that. But you have tips for us here today. So, how yes. can we make sure our conditioner is lasting longer? Long, long okay, yeah, so um, I have this um, big bottle. Yes. You know, it's um, there are some conditioners that actually fill up to this kind of big bottle. Yes. So, you know, practically you need to know how to manage this so you can actually be very last long in. Mm -hmm. So, um, there are method you could use, you could add oil mm -hmm. to the leave-in conditioner. Okay. So, you know, this way it keeps it more last long in. So here, I, you should have something like this. You know, this is just um, like, a like a spray bottle, spray bottle yes. right? Yes. That you can, you know, section, you know, um, your, your products. Okay. So you have something like this and then you could Pour a little bit of your conditioners, you know, pour them in, in a, in a in bottle, spray in a spray bottle, bottle like yes. this. They are, you know, very affordable. Mm -hmm. And then you could have like um, oils. So right here with me, I have coconut oil. Okay. So I love coconut oil, argan oil, almond oil, jojoba oil. Mm -hmm. You know, those are, you know, very recommended um, okay. oils, oils that I love. Yes. That I love to use very highly beneficial for your hair and for your scalp. Mm -hmm. So practically what you do is... You open up and then you pour mm -hmm. your oil. Okay. So this is about um, like um, one um, tablespoon okay. of, um, of coconut oil. Mm -hmm. So I pour directly into my into bottle. The, okay, into the conditioner. So I shake it up a little bit. I cover it back. I shake it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then I'm good to go on this. Okay. So practically the reason why That's I nice. advise, mm -hmm. you know, people to you know, do this method mm -hmm. is because, you know, this way you're also, you know, giving your hair some kind of treatment. Very true. Right. Very true, true. So if you have a very stubborn hair, mm -hmm. so what you do is you add up to your hair, you know, let it soak in properly into your natural hair. Mm -hmm. And then you could do a little bit of treatment. You could cover up with your shower cap mm -hmm. and then go into the shower mm -hmm. and let, you know, the, the heat from the shower run off on your hair. Okay. So another method that we yeah. could also try to do Aside from adding oil, mm -hmm. is we can add water. Water, okay. Yes, we could okay. add water to, into into um, our living conditioner. So same process, you know, I pour a little bit of my living conditioner into into a bottle like this, okay. and I add a little bit of water. How much water should we add? Um, I mean, it just depends. You could, you, if you're trying to add on your extension, you know, if you have those coily extensions, yes, yes, you yes, could yes. have you could have more water. More water than prep. Yes, than than rate. usual okay. than your natural hair. Okay. So you know, you you just like a way of just just sectioning it um, mm -hmm. in that way. Okay. So, but you know, the side effects, you need to, you guys need to know this. Mm -hmm. So if you, if you're adding water into your product, mm -hmm. make sure that you had um, product and water that you can use immediately. Okay. So okay. you don't go and add yes. water to the whole bottle. Don't go and add water to the whole oh, bottle. Yes, and yes. then you, you know, keep you somewhere. Keep so, so what will happen if you do that? Yes, if you do that, you know, um, usually when, um, when companies, when manufacturers produce um, products, they have, you know, a level of preservatives, you sure. know, that they yes, had on yes. products, you know, to make it, um, to preserve it for a very long time. Yes. So if you had water to them, you know, you have made it, you've um, imbalanced the, um, the level of preservatives yes. that you already have in the product. True, true, and you're giving it, you're giving that product room for bacteria, bacteria and, you know, and true. things like that. And that also applies to your liquid mm -hmm. soap, um, your shampoo, mm -hmm. Um, you know, anything that has to do with a um, personal care product. Okay. So you, you, you need to be careful. Like, okay. you know, I know I, I used to do it sometimes, you know, when my, my bath soap yeah, is about to finish. Yeah, you put what I And then you had... 
<laughs> what are inside. Yeah, yes, it's, <laughs> it, it's not like it's wrong to do that, yes. you know, but you need to ensure that you are using that immediately. Indeed. So, so whatever portion you want to use at that right. time or whatever you mix, make sure yes, you use make it. Yes, sure you use it immediately and, you don't store and then it, so. you, don't, you don't store it. Okay, does this so. trick also work for... And um, washout conditioners? Yes, you, you, what uh, washout conditioners? Yes, that's very important. Like I see some um, some shopping malls, you know, or toilets, you know, whereby they are um, wash the liquid wash. Mm -hmm. It's already liquid, yes, liquefied yes, with yes. water. So you need to what be careful. True, true. You need to be careful because that's very harmful to your mm -hmm. skin. You need to be careful because you don't know how long ago yes. they have added water true, to such true, products because true. that way you are practically pouring. Um, bacteria, you know, all those things, you can't see them with your naked them, eyes. True, true, so we need to be careful. True, especially your dishwasher. People right. do that a lot, <laughs> I know. <laughs> I won't call any name, but yeah, dishwasher as well. Thank yes. you so much, Oni. It's always you. amazing having you here with all these tips and bits and all of that. I must...